This video demonstrates basic blocking for both 2D and 3D geometry. Use blocking when you wish to create a structured hexa mesh or a quad mesh in 2D. The simple 2D pipe junction is a good candidate to show the basic top-down process. Start by initializing a block that surrounds the entire geometry. From the initial block, you apply an iterative process of split, delete, associate, move, and refine steps. Choose the split method best suited to the project. The screen select method allows you to drag the split to the desired location. Click the middle mouse button to accept. Click the right mouse button to cancel the split block command. Extraneous blocks are removed from the visible project, but are not deleted permanently. The split and delete steps create the block topology. Here, the topology is a T-shape, so a T-shaped blocking is required. Now the edges of the blocking will be associated with the curves of the geometry. ISOM CFD will select the correct entity. The associate and move steps will fit the block to the geometry shape. Selecting a vertex will cause it to jump to the closest point on the associated curve. You may then drag it along the curve to be sure it is at the correct corner point. ISOM CFD has automated tools to help with the move step. Multiple segments may be selected before clicking the middle mouse button. Edge segment color changes when it is associated with the geometry curve. Some manual tweaking of vertex position may be required. Use the display tree to isolate the feature of interest. You can view the expected mesh by applying parameters and enabling pre-mesh. The basic 2D blocking is complete. Now would be a good time to save before going on to refine the mesh. The same process is used for 3D geometries. Ensure that the initial blocking type suits the geometry. Apply splits. Remove extraneous blocks. Associate edges to curves. Move the vertices to the geometry. The snap option is useful when there are many vertices to move. Some manual tweaking of vertex position may be required. View the expected mesh the basic 3D blocking is complete. Be sure to save your work before going on to refine the mesh.